All right, if you know me, I love fishing little creeks, out of the way places, sometimes places that are right in the middle of town, going through a field that most people drive by all the time. All kinds of cars go by here and never think to go in there and fish in. It's uh, getting towards the end of March and I have not caught a, sing a single green sunfish yet. Now the green sunfish are always my way of knowing that the creeks have warmed up and it's springtime. It's like the, it's the last fish I catch, it's like you know, starting to catch fish throughout the spring and then green sunfish when they hit, I know everything else is hitting. The creek I'm going to hit today, I'm up near the headwaters, it really doesn't start much further upstream, comes out of the spring, but it rained like an inch last night, it poured, and it's still a little murky, so I, it's not too hot, I think I can still catch some fish, hopefully some green sunfish, and I got some stuff to help me out. So it appears I got some friends in Pradco, they've sent me some stuff before, another box, and uh, they sent me a whole box of Bobby Garlands, I got it, and I was like, where, where did this come from? Open it up, it's loaded. So I'm going to pick out a couple of Bobby Garland, some bright colored ones to use today. Ought to be perfect for in here. Try to find something that's going to catch those green sunfish. Look how bright colored this one is right there. Thought I'd attract something. I've caught some decent bass out of here before. Man, since the last time I've been here, there used to be all kinds of brush here. Good thing about the springtime is they come through and clean it up. And, uh... I got a lot more casting area. Let's see if there's some active fish. Well, nothing yet. I've had a couple little hits. Just haven't seen the fish active. Maybe there's something up in this tunnel. Sometimes I'll catch some fish out of here. Well, something hit at it. So we've got a little bit of activity. This this lure is a little long for this creek. I may have to go with a little smaller one. Ah. All right, back to back hits. It's getting their attention. I'm gonna do something. We're gonna pop this off here. Well, just pop the tail off uh, I, I think I need to get something shorter for this this creek it's definitely getting their attention but I haven't seen any of the bigger fish there's usually bigger bass and sometimes some bigger green sunfish Let's see if we can hook something there's one. Oh, okay we got a fish and a red breast okay well oh this thing is fat too um, nice beautiful red breast no green sunfish, but the red breast are like, they get active, I start catching those, and then usually I start finding some um, green sunfish. So there's a good chance. We've gotten some hits, so there's a good chance we'll get something out of this area. All right, that was the Baby Shad Swimmer Mud Dauber. Real bright colored, but these fish are just a little small, I think, for it. All right, let's go with uh, sweet tea with lemon. Sounds like a good Tennessee bait. There's one. What is it? What is it? What is it? Yes, 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 yes. Green sunfish. Big old one, too. Man, it took me a while working this area. Man, and this guy has been through uh, some rough stuff. All right, I kind of, I fished that little tunnel, fished all around, moved up here, still kept casting in. Boom! I love green sunfish. I don't know what it is. It's something, it's like they are creek fish. They are, they are what you get in a creek, and they love the creeks. They, they swim way up on the, they'll be up in the furthest most part of the creek and stuff, and that right there, that's a, that's a chunky good one with a big old gash out of him, but that's a good good quality fish right there. Man, I, that is awesome. I'm glad that they are out. I figured they were. It's just so much rain, it's been hard to fish for them. Let me show you this real real quick right here. This, um, speaking of creek fishing, I love little simple um, fishing poles and reels and not having to spend a lot of money on using something. You can just, you know, go around and fish here. This, right, this little PC fin is a PC fin uh, flame. 2000 
I've been using it a little bit. It's like a, it's like twenty-two dollars for this reel. Um, I got this five and a half foot light action pole. Something real simple and short. You can keep it in your truck, keep it anywhere. I love going to little creeks and just picking out fish with this. Now I do like nice stuff, but sometimes all you need is something real simple. And if you're looking for a real simple rod and reel, I definitely recommend the Flame. I've been using it for a little while now, and it's it's uh it's really good for the money. Got him. Oh, dude. Wow, that's a big old, that's a red breast? Goodness, that is a red breast. I don't remember what it means when they're not as colorful. It might be a male or female thing, but that is a chunky red breast. Goodness. They're up here spawning probably, they're probably I mean, I'm sure they, they, they live in these creeks. I got a lot of red breasts out of this creek especially. It usually gets really clear. They like some clear water. That, I gotta get a picture of that guy. All right, they're a little slow to hit, but there's probably all kinds of fish right in this little area that I'm um, just having to work for them. Oh yeah. Yes. Another big greenie. Dude, that's a good one. That is a good, I've been at this spot for like 15 minutes usually i'll show up and just bam catch these fish right away i don't know if it's the murky water it's probably the murky water but like usually i have no trouble hitting this getting this fish on like a first three casts <laughs> i love these green sunfish look how big their mouths are oh well, he wouldn't get back in they're so tough and just ferocious little guys All right, maybe there'd be something else up here. Another red breast. Well, they're probably pregnant, I guess, or I'm fat with eggs there. Oh, I put my new jig head on, lost that one. This is a 1 16th ounce. Ooh, I'm gonna have to order some of these. They make a, uh, I love the 1 32nd ounce. They make a 1 48th ounce. Crappy bro, uh, crappy pro. I'm gonna have to look these up. I really like these hooks, but uh, I definitely want to get some 148 ounce and some 132 ounce. And I'm back. Little hour and a half stroll through the creek. Wasn't quite as productive as I hoped for. You know, I think uh, just all this rain just made everything a little messed up. And a lot of times I'll catch a lot more fish than that, two or three times as many fish. No largemouth bass, which is strange. But I'm really excited I got the green sunfish. Um, I love going after those guys and just trying to get them. And those are a couple of chunky ones. And I had a lot of little hits, probably a bunch of little either red breasts or green sunfish hitting at it. I love all the bobby garlands I got. And I got a couple of like swim bait ones too. And uh, I'll be trying out a lot of different ones and uh, try to maybe pick one of my favorites. I love the sweet tea and lemon. That was pretty cool. And I also got something that maybe will help you out. I got a 25% off uh, code. To, uh, I'll, I'll put the info on here to, to be able to purchase more lures or lures like that. I think it's at lurenet.com, but I'll put the info on there if you're interested in buying some of that. 25% is a pretty good discount. appreciate them sending me all that stuff. Um, I love getting out here in these little creeks, just having a blast, just trying to see what's happening, just trying to see if they all come to life. Pretty soon, hopefully within like next two weeks, they should really be coming alive, uh, at least here in Tennessee. And then I'll be able to start going around to focus on more on creeks. Uh, definitely throughout the summer, I'm going to really focus on creeks, just uh, catching, you know, whatever I can catch out of them. And that's what I like to do. Thanks for watching. All right, I got a, one more place that I can usually find green sunfish up in this creek, but I got to get it because it's about to rain right now. So I got to get in here really quick before it floods. I got one. Yes, it is a green sunfish. All right, this is where I thought they'd be. They're, they're, this little spot here, it's like, there's a little creek that comes in and it goes under the bridge, but this little area, they always load up in there. I don't know why this little spot, but they're, they're definitely really active. 
Man, the weather's really getting good. Hold on, hold on. All right, there's a little one. There's some, usually some big ones in here. Right now, just the small ones. All right, let me go on the other side of these tunnels. There's a little deep hole, and uh, there may be some on there too. Yeah, there's one. Good one. Uh, that's what I was looking for. Uh, we'll fall over in the water here. All right, this guy was out of the median. It's a little deep pool. On the other side, a, a deeper spot. So I'm really excited now. This is a good one here. That's a pretty green sunfish. I see some little ones right here. There's some little guys in this little area. And when it's, it floods all the time, up and down. So they really survive well in this kind of spot. Oh yeah. This one's actually a lot deeper. Well, I guess because all the rain recently, everything's up, so there could be anything in here. There's a fish, I see it. Got him. Good green sunfish. They are definitely out and about. Pretty fish right there. There's a fish. Pretty good one. Yeah. Man, this is where they were at for sure. He's dark looking. Hope you can see that one. Well, that's that's a really pretty one. Real dark looking though. Got one. Uh, what is it? Oh, red breast, that little red breast there. I'm gonna try staying on the edge here without falling in. If I can get some casts in here. Oh, whoa, oh. yeah, there's a fish, little guy. Another green sunfish. Well, I was right about this place. They're all over this place. Oh, there's a good one. Now I know a little one. There's fish. All right, what is this? Oh, a chub. We got a creek chub too. Solid little creek chub. 